Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Caves of Cud. We are uh, on our way. We just finished with Red Rock. We're now on our way to Calamore House, which is just to the north of Red Rock. Uh, but we have some skill points to spend here because we leveled up a, a couple times. And I'm going to pick up Shield, I think. Um, we'll get Block with it. As long as you wield a shield, there is a 50% chance you block one melee attack per round. When you block an attack, you add the shield's AV bonus to your AV for that attack. So yeah, I think that's we should we should do that. I plan on always having a shield around. I was thinking about doing something with, like, my sword that I have at the moment. But I don't know that I'm going to... I think it's kind of silly to spend the skills on that one. I already have axe proficiency. So... Because I would like to find an axe laying around. Maybe, like, two axes, I think, would be the thing to do. Anyways, we are... Oh, by the way, we also have two mutation points. We're going to save those up. Once we get four, we're going to buy a random mutation. Just because that sounds exciting. And, um, yeah, we are here at Calamore House, so we're going to go ahead and, uh, and visit it and see what is going on here. I've never actually played past the Red Rock quest, so this is all new stuff for me now. Apparently this is a, uh, a large zone to build, apparently. Lots of building going on. Lots of building going on. You didn't crash on me, did you, game? There we go. We finished equip. Uh, the step travel to the historical site of Calamore House. You quest visit that. Okay, we're here. Um, don't mind my friend. What is going on here? We've got a pool of salty water, dogthorn tree. We got a couple trees. There is a feral dog and friend to fungi. He's a uh, he's neutral though. A snarling mess of matted matted hair. A wrought iron fence. We've got a a brooding azure puff, azure gills. Uh. Tense and release, just like a, it's like a big mushroom. Water wheat, lots of plants and things. Oh, there's a statue. Let's go, let's go visit the statue. Can I like walk through that? Let's go around. Excuse me, mushroom. This place is busy. Um, I can't get through. If I like break things, is it, are they gonna get like mad at me if I break things? Cause I'm gonna. Here we go. <laughs> sorry, sorry. I'm just here to visit the statue. Um, break the fence. I failed to do that. I can't break the fence apparently. Okay. Uh, we're gonna go. Can I just like look at it? Look at the statue. Shrine to Meduk. The Upper Woe. The shrine depicts a significant event from the life of the ancient sultan, Medukt. Acting against labor laws restricting the rights of scribes, Medukt led an army to the gates of Kuawar. He freed its citizens, and they crowned him Sultan of Kud. In his honor, they changed the name of Kuawar to Meduktabad. Well, that's exciting. Okay. I'm still trying to figure out what we're supposed to be doing here. I never really got a, um... Let me see what's the quest say. Oh, there's nothing really here. That, that was basically it. It's just, just come here. Oh, there is a stair thing, though. What's down here? Something to kill? We're gonna find out. As we slowly build our zone. Uh, what's going on over there? Scorpioc, the friend to fungi. Motes of salt. That's not what's... Is that what's doing it? No. I can't look at... The thing that's that's burning. Something over there is burning and there's lots of smoke getting sent everywhere. Are you attacking me? The eyeless crab... What? Leave me alone. Uh, you're gonna come at me too? Fire a shotgun. Yeah. There we go. Oh, yeah, we got him. Need to reload. Okay. Uh, where is it? Okay. Uh, yeah, fire it again. There we go. We got him. Smack him down a bit. Okay. Just gonna attack by a few dragonflies here. What is this thing? Acid weep. Let's not step in there. Okay. 
Take that, giant, giant dragonfly. Uh, something, some sort of chair thing up there, or a chest. Uh, there's a giant amoeba attacking us. Take him down. Please don't kill me. What are you? Strange tubes. Ooh, an artifact. Cave spider. Hmm, Alright. I'll pick up those strange tubes. There's a table there. Another table. Uh, let's take a look at those strange tubes we just picked up. They are... It's a metal folding chair. <laughs> okay. That's what the strange tubes are. A metal folding chair. <laughs> of course it is. <laughs> yeah, we do have crocusins. So we also have those leather moccasins. We might as well sell those things. Uh, here's some more stairs. Stairs down. Okay. Where's this going to lead us to? I suppose we don't have to be here. We're, there's, like, we're, we're not, there's not a quest here, so probably we probably should go ahead and venture on. Um, there's a door over here, too, though. Uh, what are you? A hulking baboon. Oh, baboons. All right, let's kill that guy. I oh, could have made him our friend, I suppose. We lost our other friend. Who knows where he is? What are you? Brightly lit sconce. Uh, what are you? You look scary. Cannibal and member of the cult of Kupitar. The stout human's bare skin is pallid from years of abstaining sunlight. Uh, see, front sunlight. His eyes are glazed and bestial. Isolation has rendered him more of a beast than a man. Oh, well, you would make a fine friend. It didn't work. I don't think it worked. That's the button I'm looking for, is this one. He, I, uh, infuriated the cannibal. All right. We have killed him now. Can I, uh, can I? You? Um, yeah, the sign, yeah, the giant centipede of member of Cult of Kupitar ogles you lovingly. Excellent. Alright. Take the club. I kind of like... That one. Okay, he's down. We got an amoeba over here, too. Keep an eye on my hit points. I kind of like it better that way. Uh, are you killing my friend? What's that? What is that? Glow pad. Disc of leaf of luminous vines. Mm, I will kill you. Okay, um, let's go ahead and take off. There we go. Yeah, let's go ahead and get out of here. We're in, yeah, to the nearest walkway. I want to, uh, I want to leave. I gotta walk all the way over here, don't I? Where's my stairs? There they are. Yeah, this isn't a quest, so there's no point in being here, I guess. Stairs up, so let's go up. And, alright. Dragonfly. Get out of here, dragonfly. Oh. I guess I can't hurt him. Okay. Um. Hello. Oh. Be my friend. There we go. Oh, Snapjaw guy. What are you? You are a salamander. Let's go ahead and take off. Are there? Are you hostile? Who's nearby? I don't know. There we go. So, uh, one of our quests is to make a pilgrimage up here to the Six Day Stilt. I kind of want to do that one. The other one says to get copper wire. Let's go ahead and head up here. It's a long walk, but I think we'll be fine. Uh, we're lost. Okay. <laughs> we're lost somewhere in the desert. All right, we like just now entered the desert. We're already lost. Um, so let's uh, let's load you. 
must be some easy way to load. I don't know my short key. Hot key, uh, key to load. Ooh, lots of dragonflies. They're not, like, angry at us, though. Are you angry at us? Nope. Where do you suppose this goes? Stairs down. Uh, yeah, we'll go down a little bit. I mean, we're supposed to be going to that place, but... We can take a minute to look around, I suppose. One second, we have my friend, we have a giant centipede, and we have... S someone's, uh, leaving some webs around. We're also gaining XP while we do this, so that'll always help us get some... Get some mutations. Where are you? Hello, cave spider. down. Don't kill my friend. Um, do I want to... Well, let's just venture on, I suppose. It's easy to wander around. Oh, that hurts. That hurts. That hurts. That hurts a lot. Ouch. Ouch. Um... Well, there he is. I got four hit points. Um, I have... Where is it? This thing. Apply it. Okay. Alright, we're feeling much better. I'm gonna go ahead and take this glow moth corpse because he's a jerk and he attacked me. And he hurts a lot. Alright, we're back up to full hit points now. Almost. So let's go ahead and get on here, out of here. Can I uh, make a salamander, my friend? Yeah. Hello, salamander. We gotta find our way out of here. We are lost. Oh, there we go. We regained our bearings. So now we can head back to the uh, the big world. And go back. So we're now in the, uh, the desert here. We're gonna contract a fickle gill on your feet. What does that mean? How do I see? How do I see what that means? There's my character sheet. I don't know how to look at that. And what that does to me, it doesn't sound like a good thing. Uh, we're lost again. We made it a ways, though. What do we have here? Isakari Raider. Uh, their nomads stand shrouded in robes, tattered and sun bleached. A kufaya wrapped around his neck. A kufaya wrapped around his neck and face protected against poison salt. Okay, get him, Salamander. I'm gonna blast this guy. Uh, I hit my own Salamander. Well, you know. Those kind of things happen. He has four bronze sword swords. Does he have, like, four hands or something? And a water skin. Uh, yeah, I'll take that. More short swords. And more short swords. Alright, regained our bearings. Excellent. And we are here. We made it. You finished the quest? Make a pilgrimage to the six day stilt. Excellent. We gained a level. We are now level six. Oh, we got a, our genome destabilized. Uh, destabilized. We uh, now we get to choose a mutation. We can use. We can get spinnerets. You can spin sticky, silky webs, sticky silk webs. Uh, while spinning, you leave webs in your wake as you move. Chance to resist uh, forced movement. So yeah, we can leave webs around phasing. You may phase through solid objects for brief periods of time, or precognition. You peer into your near future. You may revert to the point of time when you first use this power. That sounds kind of cool. I don't know which one I want to do. Ooh. I kind of want the webs just because it sounds cool. I mean, uh, the precognition, they all sound pretty cool, but uh, spinnerets, I want to make webs. So let's do that one. So we hit A, and we can turn spin webs. Spin webs is going to be four. We can change that number if we want to, but we can lay some webs down. Let's go ahead and do it. There we go. We're laying webs. Excellent. 
All right, hello, uh, Warden Esther, live and drink traveler. Welcome to the Stilt. Praise be to Shekinah, our sovereign, oh, sovereign fathers. Um, I see why the Chrome Stewards gather here. This is it's a petrified kraken, is it? What's in each of these tents? How about that? Are you mad? You think I keep a tally of every shopkeeper that steps foot on stilt grounds? They come and go as they please. You've got merchants of all types here. Wine sellers, honey hawkers, book binders, cobblers. To have a look around for yourself following the road around the stilt. Here's tents uh, the whole way around. Is it uh, a petrified kraken? Your own friends here, pilgrim. Stay peaceful. All right. I'll say it again then. Who knows? I've wondered uh, it myself. Sometimes she'll catch my eye when the moon's silver bright and she's bearing down on the flats. Whoever she is, she's gigantic. And old, real old. Way older than the cathedral the mechanists built inside of her. So many people. Aye, aye, the clamor of it all can overwhelm. The glow crows say, "'Twas a bird god who taught folks to gather like this in large flocks. So blame birds." Um, okay. And you're not of the faith yourself, huh? Me neither. Do go inside, though. She's a beauty. Got dyed glass high in her rafters, she does, and two marvelous carvings on the wings, plus a light sculpture of a god. Hear the sermon, too, as you like. The high priest in persuas is persuasive, but not half as persuasive as the cathedral herself. In beauty, there is power, you know. Either way, while you're in the cathedral or on the stilt grounds, stay peaceful. Okay. Thanks, buddy. I don't want to take anything. I just want to talk to the guy. So let's go uh, wander around here a bit. There's like a bunch of just walls. These are like the outer walls. Are these are there doors here? What's this say? Sign says stylish hats. Ooh, I can't wear hats. I wish I could wear hats, but I can't. Is that all you have? Yeah. I could have just bought a horn helm. I didn't need a helm. But yeah. Um, sorry, buddy. You don't do me any good. I would love to wear a hat. My salander man. How is he looking? He has a bite. I don't know. I see like his stats. I'm not sure. Are we here? Data discs. Okay. Piece of trash on the ground. You just sell data discs. Okay. What else do we have around here? There's like into the cathedral there. Let's go look over this way. Another uh, shop over this way. What are these? Oh, don't go into thorns. Thorns hurt. Cover your frail heads. Well, I wish I could. Again, skull caps. Okay. I've never messed around with tinkering, and that guy sells basic toolkits. I wonder if I should take that and uh, learn a bit of tinkering. Okay, let's head in here. Uh, Sheba Hagadias, the librarian of the stilts. Live and learn, wanderer. Have you come across any books or scrolls in your travels? Do you care to donate one of to the cathedral library? Whenever you return, you may speak to me and read anything you've donated. Uh, where is the library? Uh, we're in but the first phase of its foundation. The church has amassed a splendid collection of scripts through the years. Glorious Shekinah, praise be upon him, gifted us with several caches. The Emer uh, Eremites work day and night, reproducing them in the scriptorium, and I have taken it upon myself to beseech travelers, for the rarest finds often come from the least likely places. What use is a library in this salt den? Or in the marshes? Strangled by wild plants and poisoned by the glow? Wouldn't a stash of vine reaper serve us better? You share the pessimism of my kin, and several of the priests as well. My heart hears you, but listen to my words, and maybe you will come to fear as I do, feel as I do. To devalue wisdom is to devalue the Cassifescence. She shines in the void, refracting light, illuminating those around her. So does the written wisdom of our elders. The machinery of chromium is complex in its divinity. Don't we do a disservice to our fathers when we remain ignorant of it, of our past, of our future? Don't we deserve the joy of knowing? Bless Eskelstatz the second, first child, for he believes as I do. All right. I wish I had a book. I'd give you one. But I don't. What's over here? Is this all empty? It is. 
Uh, here's somebody fancy here. Hello, fancy person. Preacher says, he is your agent, Argent Father. Yeah, there are your Argent Fathers. Yeah, you know, you're not too fancy. Who's this? Cool. Shekinaka. Shekinaw. 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 His name is Shekinaw. I can't say it, but his name is Shekinaw. Turns towards you, his arms wide. Oh, yeah? Statue of Dagon. I order it all. Okay. Bell. Alright. Cool. What is this? A sacred well we just stepped on. That was... Oh, oh there's statues. Okay. And you are... That's you, right? Yeah, you're Eskostad the second, High Priestess of the Stilt. Disliked by antelopes for, for questioning the origins of the moon. <laughs> yes. Uh, there are the shoulders of titans, there are the hearts of krakens. Alright. There's like a grave right here. Here lies the body of mm, that guy. Anything else I can do here? Is it, I'm like in the graveyard here. Nope. Let's go over. Is there something I can do on the other side? Is there a door over here? No, no doors. That's pretty much it, it looks like. And we got some more shops out here. Shoemaker. Oh, I could use some shoes. Could I use some shoes? 89 gold for shoes? Uh, leather boots are 35. They're not that great, though. What I have is just fine. I'm going to sell you my, my leather moccasins. You can have those. Okay. What's over this way? Data disks. What are you? Gloves and mittens. What, are, what kind of gloves and mittens am I wearing? I have... Boar skin gloves, so we could use something new. Well, that's what we have. Chain gauntlets are expensive. Feathered spiked gauntlets. Ooh, that sounds exciting. That's a lot of money. Should I spend, should I squander my money on that? I don't think so. Oh, and gloves. Of all the things to squander my money on, gloves is not it. Uh, hey, little pilgrim. Welcome, uh, praise be, um, be upon Nizrok, who shelters us stilt seekers. You sell vine wafers and some bandages. Uh, I got plenty of vine wafers, buddy. more shops over this way. Boot and shoe. Mint, smoke, and wine. Huh? There's a lot of people here. Let's, uh, let's chat with uh, some folks here. Argonaut sitting says, live and drink. The good folks savage the mechanical convert. Says, humble before my fathers, I walk. I'll live and drink. Alright. Um, you just have vine wafers. Where's the traitor at? A bloody glow white shepherd of Argolot and Mechanics Cover says, May the ground shake, but the six days still never crumble. Where's the, where's the person to trade with here? There it is. Uh, you're not it. You're the... You're the... Not that guy. I thought it was the goat guy, but apparently not. 
All right. Well, whatever. What's going on over here? The preacher says, which passed through her naked womb? Mm-hmm. You are some preacher. We have a choral. There's a bunch of chorals that are singing hymns next to him. We have more pilgrims hanging around here. Don't have a sign of there. Some more uh, folks singing. We got a uh, pygmy and mechanimus convert. Pygmy of Cutter, a small twisted race of jungle dwellers. Their mottled green and black skin make them nearly invisible in the midst of the jungles. Hey, I have green skin. Water pipe and rest. I don't know the camel man. Live and drink. Uh huh. Praise be upon Nizrock. Yes, we love Nizrock. He's a great guy. Where is it? There we go. Sign says guns and ammo. So there's a lot more shotgun shells I could buy. A Borderlands revolver, a desert rifle, or a musket. I could just buy a bunch more shells, though. I will buy that. You know, it's not going to hurt having those around. It only costs one thing of water. Yeah, I'll take those. Oops. Careful walking through those things. Those hurt. It's like a uh, like shopping day here on the uh, on the game. Stylish hats, which I sure wish I could buy. Books. I love books. These books are expensive. Hmm. I would like to buy them, but you uh you cost too much. What do we have over here? Bee juice. Portable beehive. Mm. Drams of honey. That's expensive, but that's kind of cool. Okay. So we still need to go get the copper wire from that guy. I suppose we could we could venture back out that way. I'm just not sure if there's anything else we need to be doing here. Oh, it feels like there's some... I should, I'm missing something. Like, uh, there should be some sort of quest that uh, leads off from here. Data discs. It's just a big empty room, right? Yeah. Shoemaker. Who's this guy? Who are you? Pygmy Runt and Mechanimus says, uh, Glory to Chicken. Yeah, that guy. That guy's great. Right, we should stop walking through this stuff. I'm leaving my blood behind. Simples. What are simples? Tubes, weird artifacts, bark, stem... Ooh, another injector. And what are you? Boot and shoe. Are we, have we left it yet? I think we, uh, we have officially left the place. We're back in the, uh, the salt desert. Careful, Salamander, you're gonna die going through like this way. Smoke Lounge. Apples, yum. Hmm. I like apples. Those kind of apples. What, what kind of food do I have? I have plenty, right? Yeah, I got plenty. I don't know why I'm even carrying around food, because I don't eat. I guess I can eat, though. Vests and mail. That is the guy we're looking for. Alright. Bark armor. What is my, uh... I have studded leather, which you don't have. What is my, um... Actually, I can just keep talking to you. Studded leather is here. Three and then minus two. Which is, like, the same as ring mail. So nothing you have is better than what I have. A wool kilt. Do a utility knife, a bronze ingot. Yeah, nothing I don't really want. Chess pieces. 
There's some chain mail. Sooty smock. Hmm. I'm gonna buy a toolkit just because uh, I feel like I should have one. Okay. I think we're gonna leave this place. Even though I feel like I'm missing something from here. This place is massive. Some exotic liquids. Is there a fight going on? No, you're just walking through things. Uh, who are you? Just some Arcanauts. And there's another one of those guys. Yeah. Herbs and tonics. Things I just can't really afford. I'm just not, not rich enough to afford this stuff. More chest pieces. Don't don't break into the guy's chest, please. Robes, toga, yeah, ring mail. No, I don't think we can afford. Okay. We did level up. We do have some skill points to spend. We have three mutation points. We level up one more time. We're gonna get a, we're gonna get another random mutation. What is this? Tar encrusted bones. Ooh, okay. Okay, so I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna head back down here to this spot. It's gonna be a bit of a walk. I'm probably gonna get lost a couple times. Oh, maybe not. The music is getting exciting. What was this place? Rusted Archway. Let's go ahead and get that guy some copper. We're gonna stop off right here. And uh, we're gonna put a cut here before we go venture into here and try to find him like 200 yards of copper or something. Uh, anyways, thanks again for watching, and I will see you next time.